This is the video review for Transformers Generations Deluxe Class Sky Shadow and or Black Shadow. Um, he is his Japanese name or you know the name that he was in the original Japanese cartoon was Black Shadow. Now in the toy he is Sky Shadow. So he is a retool of the Transformers Generations Deluxe Thunderwing. Um, which it has two minor, two uh, new different two differences, which I shall get to in robot mode because they are robot mode features. Um, now he is done up in mostly great red, black, and silver pla uh, plastic and paint. Um, he has some gray, which is really revealed in robot mode. Um, you can see some on his feet there and on the guns, but you know, um, he's other than the two small differences, uh, there is absolutely no difference between the two figures. Um, like I said, except for the two small differences, if you pay, uh, you can still, you know, pull out that and peg it back in. It pegs in very snuggy, snuggly, whatever you want to call it. So, God, it just shot me. This is not the first time it has shot me. This is my second take of this video, and it shot off to the other half of the room on the first one. <laughs> so, yeah. If my camera will focus. There we go. He's got great detailing on the, the body, on the top of the plane there, as you can tell. <clears throat> which it's still the same as Thunderwing. So, I do not have Thunderwing to compare in in jet mode. I shall compare them in robot mode, because that's really the only reason. That's the only real thing to that's different. So, to transform them, what you want to do is you just want to fold those pieces down. Then you want, then you want to... Uh, take the, the uh, guns off, fold these pieces out, unpeg this piece, and unpeg the front piece here. Oh, don't forget to fold the landing gear up. Then take this piece, and fold it up, and then f while it's folded up, you want to take this piece and fold it back, and then fold this on top of it. Then close up those little pieces there, then open up this section here, fold <sighs> very tight. Right. Oops, his leg just popped off. That is the first. There we go. Oh, that pegged in nice and tight. I like that. Does it peg how snuggly, snuggly it pegged in? How snug. There we go. Uh, then you want to fold the feet out like that. Like so. Then the only differences between Thunderwing and Sky Shadow com to complete the transformation, let me just come up here, uh, is you fold this new chest piece down to reveal his new head. So two new additions, and they are both in the last step of transformation. He has a new head and a new chest piece. So uh, let me peg in. Let me peg in the. Uh, the guns there, so I can bring out Thunderwing. There we go. Just position now. Okay. Like that. So, uh, and here is a comparison with Thunderwing. And as you can see, like I said, the only differences is obviously the colors, the paint, uh, the, well, not just the paint, the remolded chest piece, which has paint on it now. I mean, that's what I meant to say. Um, the re the, uh, re the new chest and the uh, new head are the only two differences on the figure. So, yep. So let me bring Thunderwing out. Let me bring him into the spotlight. Um, so, I'm going to try to do something here. Um, one of my one of the best features of this guy is easily his head. All right, as you can see, there he that that uh, that's an absolutely gorgeous head design. And that's that red. That's not paint, people. That's uh, that's light piping. Look at that. That is light piping. Um, that's absolutely gor great and gorgeous. I'm, I almost said gorgeous. Ugh, my, I'm getting a little tongue tied today. Gorgeous 
light piping and a gorgeous face for this figure. He's got his horns there, as you can see. He's got the silver face with a little bit of, you know, like the, like the, uh, you know, the the uh, the sack, you know, the, the little black lines under your eyes if you haven't slept in a while. You know, he's got that. It's absolutely great. Oops. It's about not knock my camera off of the uh, tripod here. Let me just get it right back in. Okay. Sorry, knocked my camera off my tripod temporarily. So, there is Sky Shadow, or Black Shadow, whatever you want to call it. Articulation-wise, it's still the exact same as um, Thunderwing. Well, it's actually a tad bit different due to the head. Um, he's got ball-jointed uh, shoulders. He, he can rotate the upper bicep, has uh, the, the articulation at the elbow, and hands on a wrist swivel so they can go 360. His head rotates on a ball joint. Uh, can go 360, but it goes at a really weird angle, so if you rotate it like 180 degrees, it, you know, it kind of gives him horns for a face, because it kind of rotates up at an angle. Um, yeah, so, uh, and also the uh, legs are on ball joints still, obviously, uh, forward and back, side to side, bend at the knee, hasn't have the feet articulation, so... Um, if I had to choose one of the two figures, I would definitely choose Sky Shadow because he has he has the dominant colors in my opinion. Although red, black, and silver are my three favorite colors, um, so that might ha I might be a tad biased. But how much more awesome does that look compared to you know compared to uh, the Thunderwing? There we go. How much more awesome does that look compared to Thunderwing? I think very. <laughs> so. I don't know, it's up to you guys, but I absolutely think it's a great, great figure. You know, mine has absolutely perfect paint apps. It's a t he has his little tiny Decepticon logo there, which does, which isn't even blemished. Um, you know, he's got his absolute, he's got great paint apps. You know, I don't know if there's any, you know, common paint mistakes on this guy. I, I, I don't know, I've only seen this one at retail, although a Target, like, I got this, these two from Hasbro Toy Shop. Uh, him and Junk Heap, I got from Hasbro Toy Shop. Um... Yet I heard, and I heard that uh, that um, a Target like two minutes from my house has the uh, has the both of them, which I'm a little upset about. But still, um, these were both. I didn't even have to. I didn't have to pay for tax or anything because Hasbro Toy Shop has that sale going on right now. No tax, no shipping charges. So that was nice. So yeah, it's an absolutely a great figure. Um, absolutely love both of them. Um, which I will do Junk Keeps review soon enough. So uh, there you guys have it. A great, great figure in Transformers Generations Deluxe Class Sky Shadow.